good morning girls we are starting with the new rule indirect indirect today and you know before we start we always revise the summary number 1 who is speaking number 2 how is speaking number 3 replace inverted commas by the word that number 4 first person changes into third person number 5 verb changes into past tense number 6 past tense changes into past perfect tense by adding had let's start with the new rule that is rule number 12a part 2 that is present tense if the reporting verb is in the present tense then the verbs in reporting speech will not change let's see through examples number 1 they say reported speech say present tense we have shifted to another house they say that they have shifted to another house sara says i love and respect my parents Sara says that she loves and respects her parents. Why do we have uh, why do we add s with love because with he she it we always add s or es with a verb in simple present tense. Number 3 he says she has written me an encouraging letter. He says that she has written him an encouraging letter. Number 4 The teacher says she has always been a good student. The teacher says that she has always been a good student. Number 5 Ali and Zeb say we want to go home. Ali and Zeb say that they want to go home. Now time to give you homework so you can practice at home. Number 1 the old lady says I am a poor lady. Ahmed says I am busy right now. The boy says I am not a thief. The child says I am working very hard. Number 5 they say we are going for a picnic. So please practice it in your neat copies. Thank you.